Whoa, y'all know the motherfucking vibes live in the motherfucking purple shell, but we not at the motherfucking purple shell because we at a motherfucking event right now and we just motherfucking talking to people. Are we talking to people? What's up, my boy? What up, my guys? Network G, please believe we here. Mob, that's ratchet mob in this bitch. You understand? We here. Babe, I love the fucking intro, dog. Sure. My guy. Intro Leo, oh, let me get your mic all the way right next to you. There you go. Boom, so they can got down all the way here, you man. So where you from, dog? Uh, I'm from Flint, Michigan. I've been out here for a couple of years. Yeah, I got a good record going on. Ratchet Mob, Eternal Riders, we here, we here, we here, we here, we here, we here, I'm working on my newest project right yeah. now with uh, John Boy, uh -huh. future producer John Boy. Oh, shit. We got some shit going on with Nine Souls and me on the new project, the yeah. new project. So that's his tag, what it do. Yeah. I want to enunciate the work producers, you know what I'm saying? Nobody even knows what you're saying, you know what I'm saying? Like, they, they, back in the day, by the pound, everybody knew Timberland, like everybody knew who the producer was. Yeah. The rap game changed so much, the producer don't get no love. Yeah, facts. So this project is all about the crap, because we can't do this shit without the yeah, facts, dog. Ain't nobody DJ D Rec cutting the beat no more, dog. We got, we need the beat. <laughs> for sure, for sure, for Niggas sure. need the beat. <laughs> Not like that though. <laughs> Yo, please give us the beat. Yo, that's dope as shit, dog. So, so tell me, who, um, what's one of your favorite producers out of out of everybody? What's one of your favorite ones? See, I'm like, from Michigan, you know what I'm saying? So, Bernard Terry was the hottest producer we ever had. Yeah, from that's dope, dog. And I ain't nothing. Damn, man, R.I.P., dog. And I missed the opportunity to work with him. Yeah. That kind of... Bro, I know how, bro, I know how yeah. you feel, dog. This I could have worked with him and missed the opportunity. I moved out here. Damn. Damn, man. You always pick his tomorrow, bro. Facts, dog. Take advantage of opportunities. Bless, though. Facts, dog. Don't miss no so, opportunities, kid. Hop on them. <laughs> Damn, so, dog. It's amazing that you even out here, dog. Yeah, man. I just, I just got hit by 18 wheeler <laughs> <laughs> a couple months ago. That been flipped six times. Damn. Yeah, UPS 18 wheeler was like blind side of the same I thought you said you moved down here in an 18 wheeler. No, oh, I moved oh. down here two years ago. I just got yeah. hit by 18 wheeler. Oh, damn, nigga, and damn. I'm around, you know Yo, it's amazing, dog. Hey, it's Bless crazy. I thought you said, hey, I just came down here in an 18 wheeler. Uh, I got smacked. Damn. By <laughs> But I'm Damn. here to talk about it. You yeah, know you were here vibing and lit as fuck. As soon as you got on that bitch, you couldn't tell you got hit by no guy now. 18, will it? Oh, yeah, yeah. God damn. Uh, you see me walking with <laughs> <laughs> yeah. But at least you doing your motherfucking thing, dog. Love for man. I'm so, out here, man. I fucking love y'all platform, bro. I just tapped in, but it was cold bloody. Yeah. I had to fuck with it. Bro. Yeah, man. That's it, man. Purple shell. Man, appreciate you, dog. That's the thing, bro. For real, purple shell. Yeah, man, you definitely need to pull up, man. We need to get down here. We need to leave. we need at least hear like three or four or five of them songs. Oh uh, man. man, let's tune in. Network G, N E T W R K Space G, Network G, Tap Network in, G, man. YouTube, Spotify, all digital platforms. Everywhere. Out here, eight hard to find. Facts. Here. Appreciate you, dog. So, man, we been pulling up over here, dog. We motherfucking vibes, dog. Man, <laughs> hey, there's so many fine chicks in <laughs> Oh, yeah, they here, too. <laughs> All right, my boy. All right, Watch out for the haters, because they out here. <laughs> oh, no, I got something for the haters. You can't bring it in. They got some Thanks. <laughs> the Purple Shell. Whoa, y'all know the motherfucking vibes, man. We fucking at the purple shit. We ain't at the purple shit. I keep saying yeah. that, dog. We here. This is dope ass event, dog. Everybody got some dope shit going on. And I just, my boy just walked by. We was just like, yo, we got the motherfucking interviews going. He sat down. Let's go, man. Yeah, <laughs> What's up, man? Yeah. Let What's people up? know who you is. My name is Baby Terry. I'm a videographer out of Atlanta. For real? Uh, I be doing all type of video music videos for all type of rappers and shit like that. For real? Yeah. How long you been doing videos? I really been doing this shit for like a year now. For real? Just, 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 just yeah, a year. Yeah, dope as shit, dog. Yeah. Yeah, but I done accomplished a lot of shit. Just yeah. God done blessed me more than enough. Facts. It's Facts. a blessing. So far, what's your favorite video you done done? Uh, my favorite video so far is probably the one I just did. I had just shot um the baby, the baby. Uh, he had back, uh, baby on baby tour. Um, yeah. I just he had a tour in Atlanta. Um, I, I was shooting for DJ Lil Mark. Um, 
Shout out DJ Lil Mark. Shout out DJ yeah, Lil Mark yeah. and EV. What's up? And yeah, uh, that was that, that's the latest video I just did. Like every video is just keep shit. getting bigger and bigger. So bad. Yeah, now you out here grinding a yeah, year yeah. Out, in a year of video videographer going crazy. Already on stage with Lil Bike Man. Come on, man. Yes, sir. I'm motherfucking impressed, dog. Hey, yeah, man. <laughs> oh man, let, let people know more about what you do. Shit. Well, right now I'm in. I'm not just a videographer. I do photography. Yeah. Graphic design. I do a lot of stuff in the city. Um, but mainly, mainly I just be saying like I be doing like everything like as far as artist development. Yeah. I do a lot of stuff. Anything developed like that's to do with art, you know, branding right. out businesses and stuff like that. I do all that stuff. So y'all can follow me on Instagram, Baby Terry, Baby T I R R Y. Baby Terry. Oh man, we definitely gotta tap in with you, dog. We need more videographers, dog. You see, we only got one camera over here. Yeah. We got more cameras. We ain't got that many cameramen. I'm an artist, but I'm a cameraman too. On the side, I'm gonna tap in with this. this <laughs> yeah, guy. man, definitely, dog, man. We really appreciate you sliding through the goddamn yeah. purple shell side podcast on the side in the back of the goddamn event, dog. We in this bit, man. Tapping my motherfucking boy, dog. Motherfucking videographer going up in a whole motherfucking year already, dog. Y'all know no motherfucking vibes. We out there, bit, dog. The purple shell. Thank you, my boy. I'm straight on that. I'm going to the purple shell. Yo, y'all know the motherfucking vibes. We live at the motherfucking. I keep saying we live at the motherfucking purple shell. Cause we here is in a purple shell in a different motherfucking spot. Yo, but this cool ass chick right here, like she was over there, like at this vendor thing over there, and she. Peace City Customs. Peace City Customs. That's what it's called. Pound Peace City Customs. Pound Peace City Customs. She was over here chilling the whole time. We was over here setting up, and she just like, when y'all gonna be done? So I couldn't wait to get her over here. So what's up? Hello. Okay, I'm here with Peace City Customs. Y'all come fuck with us. You already. Back. So what all y'all Anything do? you want custom, we can do it. Anything? Anything. A custom refrigerator? Done. For Magnets. Hey, this podcast, I'm going to do Give me a refrigerator. <laughs> 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 so what's one of the craziest custom things you, y'all had to make? This man. Okay, so. Yeah. <laughs> His logo was booty, and we had to make it. Y'all made That's all I'm going to say. Y'all made a booty? You know, like his logo was booty. Like, it was terrible. Oh, it was whack? Yeah, it was like a duck, and I didn't know. I never knew it was a duck. I thought it was like a bear, but it was a duck. Ah! (laughs) (laughs) Did you say a bear? I thought it was a bear, but it was a duck. You thought it was a bear, but it was a duck. Hey, I can't wait to see. I, I really want to see what that uh what that logo look like to make a bear look like a duck. To make you think that. It was it is. I, I swear. <laughs> it didn't have no beak. I'm not going to make myself look slow on here. Oh, a beak? The, uh, the front part? Yeah, but I still thought it was a bear. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I mean, That's funny as fuck. Yo. Okay, tell me. Okay, now I'm finna switch it and interview oh, you. Oh, what's up, okay, what's up? so what is the purple shell? Uh, the purple shell is actually like a platform, a network where we do like uh, different entertainment things, different media things. Um, we uh, do interviews. We got live performances, do podcasts. We got this uh, the uh, the world famous phone booth thing where people rap on. The phone booth is that the spot yeah the phone booth ain't on there but all of them then did the phone booth like um we didn't have uh we actually do shorts too uh we do everything media really uh we do game shows uh i throw events um yeah the purpose show we do so much shit uh, it's like it's, it's a whole network we like uh tyler perry but like with more shit going on okay. than just uh movies because we like we really tune in with the artists because uh we actually was artists and we just like doing stuff or having shit that we could do on our own you know how people always trying to charge you for music videos and shit so we just learn how to work the camera ourselves they charge us for fucking backgrounds so we just built the backgrounds ourselves they charge us for interviews so we just made the interviews ourselves i can do it myself <laughs> Thanks, right. man. That's the fucking vibe. Well, I bet this your first time having a teacher. Shout out you to all teacher? my teacher bags. Oh, shit, what you teach? I teach sixth grade science. You teach sixth grade science? Yeah, with the baby kids. Man, I used to fail sixth grade science. That's because your teacher wasn't good. I, I wasn't good. Oh. <laughs> my teacher probably telling us all the right shit, and I just was fucking up. Uh, but I like science a lot. Yeah, I teach science. What's your favorite thing about science? The earth. We live on. The earth? So you love, so you, oh, so you with the global warming things? Okay. Okay, don't let him make you think I'm weird or anything like no, that. No, I we, just care about the we, world that we live on. We, we just, need to make sure we, we keep just, it safe. We just making sure that we making sure that you love green. You vegan? Yeah, nah, yeah, nah, I forgot that shit. <laughs> I just had me some jerk chicken right over there. Grubhub. Oh, you told that shit up. Hey, they Grubhubbing over here? You better know some. Man, what 
out there. I don't know why they tell me they'll grub over there, nigga. We can grub over here. Did you get it custom? Custom grub hub. From over there? Oh, it's like an actual club called custom grub. Nah, I'm just saying because you got a custom shop and I figured you make your wings custom ones. Y'all don't hear nobody else over there on Lions? Hey, Lions, Lions, I ain't even know that button was gonna work like that. Okay, this is cool though. I like y'all. Man, we appreciate it's you for coming over here. Hey, y'all, I'm about to come over there and see about some custom y'all stuff. Y'all can pull up, do this same setup at our shop. Pick it up. Nah, just like. <laughs> yeah. But again, PC the custom. Also, we do cater to the kids too. We do bounce houses. She play, come get at us. Everybody's having a birthday party year round. We can go anywhere. For real? Man, I'm about to have a motherfucking birthday party, man. You like ball pits? We can do ball pits. Hell yeah, I like ball pits. You can go Y'all got ball pits for real? That'd be so fire. How much would it cost? How much it cost to do it just for like a music video? Like, I just need like some hours. I don't know. Come get that. Come. Come talk to me. Oh yeah, definitely, man. We're gonna get us a bounce house, and, man. Yeah. I, man we, I, we Adult bounce here, house, man. Hey, tell them where to follow you at again. At Peace City Customs or at Sheik underscore Play. Y'all know the motherfucking vibes. Y'all motherfucking follow her because I'm gonna get some custom shit. We're going over there right now. I'm gonna holler at y'all later. Bye. This is so cool. I like this. The purple shell. Whoa, we live in one of the coolest events I've ever been to. And the dopest thing is we just keep running into people. And Tsunami just brought me another cool person over here. Yo, what up? How you doing today, man? What's popping, man? It's your man Parlay, Rose Collection. Man, I've been seeing y'all over there, man. Y'all shit dope. Man, I appreciate it, bro. We work hard, you know, trying to provide you know, quality product. Um, you know, something that's urban, something that's trendy. Yeah. And uh, we be living, um, let people get their roses while they're here versus when they go. Oh, that's they're, dope. Yeah. Hey, that's dope as fuck. I love that. I love y'all bags and everything. I love the way it just look like a bouquet of roses coming out the bag. You dig? That's we, beautiful. Dog. Like, like for instance, <laughs> who don't like roses? Bags. I mean, you know, I have friends that I've lost, family members, and we give them roses when they're gone. We want them to give them while they're here. Like people say, give people their flowers. Yeah. I believe in giving them the roses. That is so dope. Yeah. Uh, I, I love that, yo. How long you been doing it? Um, it started right before pandemic. Bruh. January of 2020. And boy, it was tough the first few months because you know when everything was shut down. But yeah. we kept pushing. We're still pushing. Now we got dope. NBA stars wearing our stuff. Jalen Rose, hey. uh, Jalen and Jacoby, um, of NBA TV. Former NBA All Star. That's amazing. Spliff Star, Buster Ryan's right hand is my um, brand ambassador. Yeah. What up, Spliff? Um, um, you got Capadon from Wu Tang, Wu Tang Forever, wearing it on tour. Um, <laughs> Drummer Boy, uh, Drummer Boy Fresh, the, one of the coldest producers in the game. Thanks. His store, uh, House of Fresh. What up, Harry? Uh, my man who runs the store. Drummer store sell more of our exclusive stuff than any. Uh, Store around the country, so Bird. big up, yeah, yeah. We're doing House of Fresh too. House of Fresh, man, and yo, House of Fresh is really and pick up the tea with exclusive game. Uh, he sells a lot of the caps, um, oh, you know. So we, so we moving and shaking right now. We just we're a new oh, yeah. brand, but y'all in the best stores though. Oh man, we get in there, bro. The best stores. We're in North Carolina. We're in LA. Uh, we're in Jacksonville, Florida. Oh, so y'all let that pandemic work, y'all, y'all. Come on, there. man. We, hey, listen. This now, I got to give big up to uh, Chris and the um, Atlanta Streetwear Market. This market, I started it, or started attending it as a vendor um, last fall. Yeah. Ridiculous on the sunny, like we're on the second day today. Same thing today. We went to the summer one. Yeah. We did this the, uh, Sunday, and we also uh, um, doing the sunny today. And still getting sales out just like we did last time. Yeah, so this, big up this, to the Atlanta Streetwear Market. Yeah, I love this Atlanta Streetwear Market. Uh, event. Yo, this is super dope. They like, come through. People come here to shop, and that's what I like about it. Yeah, thanks. we're selling. They're shopping. We meant for each other. Yeah, thanks. Uh, it's, it's beautiful connection, man. And big up to y'all, man. What is it? Purple Show, right? Yeah, the Purple Show. You know, we do podcast. We do so much uh, podcast, yeah, and media stuff, man. Yo, big ups, man. I appreciate um, it. I support you guys like you guys support us. Man, appreciate, appreciate you, man. I'm happy I got to meet you, man. I've been over here watching, just sitting there, like, man, they got some of that dope. <laughs> Sit over there, man. man we we'll appreciate love, it, bro. I, I love it, man. I love it, man. Y'all you know, keep grinding, man. Brown people supporting brown people, and even the Caucasian. We our first two sales a day, honestly, yeah. were by Caucasian, man. but they like what we do because 
that we're the, we're the actual culture. Yeah, we're fact. the culture of urban streetwear. So they come and support us, and we appreciate them as well. Fact. We don't knock on any races, but when Brown support Brown, I really appreciate it. Yeah, fact. That really makes me want to stay in this business for a long time. Yeah, facts, man. I love it, man. I'm, I'm happy we got somebody like you that got a, that got the passion to make something, something so dope, because I love the way you was like, give people their roses while they're here, give them their flowers while they're here. That shit is so fucking cool, it's man. It's real talk. I, I really believe in that, because every single person that I've lost, I've been to the funerals, been to the wakes, Mm -hmm. Everything and we giving them flowers, mm -hmm. but they really transcend into a new new life. Yeah. We need to give it to them now. Let them know how much we appreciate them while they're here. Yeah, fact, yeah. Dog. So I that's all your family members: your mothers, your fathers, uncles, nieces, your sons and daughters. Everybody needs their flowers while they're here. Fact. And that's why we're gonna take this thing to a whole nother level. Um, you can follow us at Official Rose Collection mm -hmm. on all social media platforms. Official Rose Collection. Oh yeah, y'all definitely tap in, dog. Uh, Cause I, even though y'all can't see it, cause it's behind us, I'm telling y'all, it's fire. It's fire. <laughs> we here, baby. It's fire. Here. Free station, great, y'all. We do, I, man. I, I, I love it, dog. Uh. I love it, man. For sure. Come out and support us, man. We here till nine o'clock tonight at the Atlanta Streetwear Market. Come out here and purchase something. Get you a trucker cap, get you a new beanie, Bags. get you a hoodie, get you one of the coldest velour sweatsuits you're ever going to see. Bags. You know, they retail it in the store for 500 but today you get them for 300 You know what I'm saying? Knocking off a hey, whole 200 Hey, y'all better pull up right now because this is the only place you're going to get a deal like that. Come on. Y'all better get up here right a a ASAP. ASAP. <laughs> ASAP Rocky. Bags. You dig? We appreciate y'all, fam. For man, real. appreciate you, man. Love, man. Love. Keep doing what you're doing, man. Keep making the world a beautiful place. Keep uh, putting on for the culture. Keep giving people their roses while they're here, man. We fucking love it, dog. Appreciate you too, fam. Appreciate you, man. Wow, we out. Peace. Thank you, man. Website. Yeah. Get dirty with the turtles. Whoa, we live at the Atlanta Streetwear Expo. Y'all know what's going on, man. We hey, we running into people like we running into people, man. What up, my guy? Hey, what's good? you got a camera and everything, man. Oh, Take man. pictures too. Oh, man, I just gonna look at everything. So what? Yeah, let the people know who you is and what uh, all you do. Charles, Charles Richardson. Uh, yeah, investment real estate man mainly. Um, yeah, I do have a podcast. Yeah. Working on the clothing line. Day trade. I do a little bit of everything, man. Damn, you're so real estate and you own. And you got a podcast, too? Yeah, man. What's your got podcast it. called, man? We got to get on there. Visionary podcast. Visionary podcast? Yeah. Oh, man, it's not, it's not y'all be talking deep on there. Yeah, man, I'm, I'm, I'm kind of deep, man. I, really? I, I like to break things down. You know? Hey, what's your favorite thing to break down? Like, something that you always make sure that you, like, you got to let people know ASAP. you like, hey, man, I, I got to wake your mind up with this real fast. Everybody different. <laughs> you should be like yeah. you should read somebody and be like ah you need to know this yes, sir. <laughs> right. Every, everybody got a different type of energy yeah. so we got to build the energy and then um, we just started to break things down so I mean but I, I like that question though like, yeah. what's my favorite thing like one of my favorite things to help anybody understand that you know we're, we're pretty we're unlimited yeah thanks you feel me like, like we, can, we can do Pretty much whatever Anything. Uh, facts. <laughs> That's <laughs> dope as shit. Facts. People weren't even going to, going to the moon until somebody really was like, hey, man, we really need to go there. First, the shit just seemed like it's way too fucking far out of reach, but shit, you can get there. That's crazy. Yeah, exactly. That's somebody dope as shit. Facts, man. So, I mean, yeah, I mean, everybody needs to stay motivated. Yeah. We have crazy times right now, so we, we just got to keep motivating each other and making sure we got that all the best for Biggest facts, dog. I, I love the fact that you do so much, like, that you do so much shit. Because not that many people, everybody out here is just like, sometimes people just gravitate to one thing and just let that one talent be the thing that they just harness in, which is cool. But, like, it's like, like you said, like, we can do whatever we want to do. And so, shit, why limit it shit to one thing? Like, why limit yourself? <laughs> Fucking do it all, the fuck? So, I, that's, that's crazy as fuck when you first walked over and then you said you got, uh, you had the camera and you like, oh, I do a podcast, I do real estate. I'm like, that's not even the first, that's not what I thought first when I saw you. <laughs> I was like, oh, we got a camera, he must take pictures, or he's a videographer, he must do something like that. And he was like, I actually do real estate, I'm actually, you know, that's, that's dope as shit, dog. I love that, dog. Moments, that's man. dope. <laughs> that's cool as shit, all right? Keep the fucking the talents at at a, at, a, at a all time multiple high. Yeah. I, I hate when people feel like you should disappear and do everything. Like, yeah. Like, no, I mean, you know, we should be able to express our creativity in many different ways. So. Yeah, thanks. 
Thanks, dog. I fuck with that, dog. Let the people know something else you want them to know about you, fool. Hey, just, just look out, man. You know, I'm, I'm really, I'm really just starting my journey of, uh, you know, putting myself out there. Yeah. Uh, you know, letting people know who I am, but you know, in several areas, you guys are the Man, definitely. I love the part. I, I love you doing real estate. Like most people ain't barking up. Yo, I'm a real estate agent too, dog. That's dope as no, shit. No, 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 no. That's I'm amazing. not an agent. I'm oh, you're not an agent. You just in the real estate. Yeah. Oh, oh, that's dope as shit no, too. Shit, shit. As long as you in a in a lane outside of what the norm is, like from what like what your your main thing you do. Because most people are like once you in media, you just doing media. Or once you in music, you only do music. Or once you do something, you only do something. But like. <clears throat> Those two lanes are so, like, not the same. So it's like, it's like you using a lot of your brain because you got to be artistic, then you got to be fucking... It's just that's some cool shit, dog. Hey, See, you using I, hella brain work, dog. It's, all, it's, <laughs> it's a whole different avenue lane, dog. I fuck with that. That shit dope as shit. Hey, hey, it's it's crazy. Everybody just keep walking by. I just know that everybody's starting to have cameras. Like it's just like there's a camera everywhere. <laughs> Oh yeah, yeah, that's dope as shit, dog. I fuck with that. <laughs> <laughs> shit, dog. Man, tell me where to find you at again. Yeah, uh, so my Instagram, Trade the Visionaries, was Trade underscore Visionary. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I mean, that's the main, that's the main place. Yeah. I mean, uh, podcast is uh, the Visionary Podcast. It's B-I-C-H-E-N-E-R-E. -E. So I spelled it a little different. Yeah, I was it's thinking. The, it's the way you actually pronounce visionary. So yeah. you can uh, break down the syllables. Yeah. That's dope as fuck, dog. Uh, I fuck with that, dog. appreciate you coming on the podcast, dog. Thanks for having me, man. Let's make sure y'all tap in, man. Hey, the line of street work got some cool ass people in there, motherfucker, dog. <laughs> Definitely, dog. <laughs> He take a picture last minute. <laughs> All right, bro. Whoa, y'all know the vibes live at the Leonard Streetwear, yo. This fucking shit is dope as shit, man. The purple shell, we lit it a bit. Just running into people. And I just ran into King Vaughn. Yo, yo, yeah, yeah, yo. Hey, bro. Let everybody know you here, man. Hey, man. I'm Jay, man. Jay. Jay. Rich 3 on Instagram. This my boy right here. Jam Jones production over here in the cut, baby. We lit. Oh, so you y'all production company? You, you a producer? Okay. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. So y'all team. So what all y'all do? Hey, man. Film, video, music videos, shows, commercials, For anything you want. Yeah. Oh, man. We, hey, man, we, we, we've been a link over so many people. We need to, we need to hire these guys. Huh? Talk to, talk to <laughs> so what? So what all? Uh, so what all videos y'all do? Anything really? We just. Did a music video, we come shoot it. You did a promotion video, we yeah. come shoot it. Y'all doing commercials too? Yeah. Y'all doing commercials? Say, yeah. We ain't really enough putting nothing out, but oh, yeah. it's, but, but yeah, it's like, talent there. Yeah. Like, I know we can do it. Like It ain't that hard to do a commercial. We can do a commercial. <laughs> talent there. <laughs> What's our company called? My JR Film. Yeah. J.R.S. Film. Jim Jones Productions. Jim Jones You said Jim Jones? Jam. J-A-M-M. Say it again. Jam. 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 Oh, okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, I was like, Jim Jones. <laughs> hey, you do like Jim Jones' son, my boy. <laughs> Just realize that, my boy. Okay. Okay, we got King Von and Jim Jones' son in here, bitch. Let go. A whole bunch of talent, man. So, uh, so both y'all shoot together or y'all shoot separately or y'all y'all work out? Y'all just run y'all movies together? Two cameras at the same time? Yeah. Oh, that's that's how we like <laughs> Thanks, dog. Everybody both. need two cameras at the same time. Both cameras the best. What's y'all what's favorite, favorite thing y'all done shot so far? Like, somebody video that y'all was like, man, this shit was so motherfucking fun shooting it. All right, so I was in the studio for the first time. I went to an actual studio session. Yeah. Man, you know how I get that. Yeah. Dude, everything just like, I swear, it wasn't a dull moment. Never lights just going off. Yeah. Everybody just vibing, having a good time. You know, the video came out straight, so it's like the vibe there, so the video was you know yeah, thanks. It's like, oh, yeah, everything already perfect. Shit, y'all just keep doing what y'all like, do. I didn't have to we'll do shit. Yeah, yeah. Type of shit. That's dope as shit. You was there? No, no, I wasn't oh, there. Oh, but you tell me about yours then. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Let me you, know so, <laughs> we was in Miami. I was in Miami. Yeah. So. <laughs> hey, that's when you really like when when you when you say something and you ain't even get to the story, but you look at your partner and he like, hey, oh, yeah. you know, man, I'm like, hey Miami, we yeah, did man, that Miami. We was out there for about a couple days, man. Me, family, and all that yeah. shit. But it went off, man. Production, 
pictures, all that, man. Miami on the boat. Yeah, first time on the yacht, man. First time on jet skis. Acting a fool out there, though. Damn, that had to be the fucking vibes, yo. It was lit. <laughs> Damn. Hey, these, hey, hey, these guys with the cameras having hella fun. Like these niggas must be the hey, must be the superstars. Check us out, man. We on the rock. Man, God, I mean, we definitely got a link up with y'all, boy, man. man like, we turkey. <laughs> Thanks, man. Thanks, dog. I fuck with y'all. Oh yes, hey, sir. Let, let them know where to find y'all at again. Hey, man, on Instagram, J Three. Follow my business page, jrfilm Three. You know what I'm saying? Yes, sir. Y'all follow me on the gram, Jam Jones Productions Inc. Underscore, baby. Jam Jones Productions Inc. Yeah, man. Yes, y'all better, better tap in, man. Get some shit shot by these boy, man. Get these boy over here extra grinding. They, they at Atlanta Street wearing. They got them grinding videos. Y'all know the fuck going on, man. Y'all better tap in, man. We got this bit. Right, yes, sir. Oh, the purple shell. The purple shell. Whoa, live at the motherfucking Purple Shell at the motherfucking Atlanta Street Wear event now, and we kicking shit, just meeting people, and you seem super cool and shit. Let the people know who you is. Hey, my name is Sierra Oh, shit, but I, I heard professional softball, though. So you play professional softball? For real? I was going to play university before you uh, graduated in 2020, and now I'm playing softball. Oh shit, that's fucking dope as shit, yo. So you be <laughs> throwing that thing. <laughs> I'm an outfielder. So oh, I'm so you be catching that yeah. thing, okay? All right, we got you. All right, okay. Man, I'm super dope at uh, um, probably not softball, but I'm fire at kickball. Yeah. Like I'm super fire at kickball. I I was on a professional kickball team. Well, I know that's hard. Yeah. Yeah, cause I, I, I so a couple times I played outfield, got like a, a more than more than more than a couple outs too. I probably got like I got, I got like ten outs on under my belt. I'm pretty good. The last time I played kickball was probably elementary school. Bro, are you missing out? They play kickball a lot at Piedmont Park. I, I uh, my team's out of Florida. I'm oh. here missing my parents. Oh, that's so lit. So you ain't even, you ain't even here. So you a softball team out of state. That's so dope. <laughs> Yo, what's our softball team out here? I need to know who, who I ain't been rooting for lately. Dang. I don't know. There's not a pro team out of Georgia. I think they are trying to come up with a team because Georgia, Atlanta, it's Atlanta. Yeah, Everybody facts. knows. Yeah, so thanks. I think they're trying to get Why wouldn't they have softball? Exactly. They tripping. Exactly. I don't yeah. know. I don't know. I was in college. My uh, oh, a whole bunch of my homegirls, they play softball. So I thought it was like super dope. But I, I just, I, I don't know. I, I, I couldn't hit it. Because when they do this yeah, too many no, times, yeah. I'm throwing the fuck off. I'm like, what the hell is that? Yeah, I was, no, I was confused there. <laughs> everybody has to I'm, I'm 24 and it's still, it's still yeah, that shit difficult as hell. Like you, you not just finna go out there and think you finna be a softball pro, oh, yeah. and that's why it's super dope. I did that you won, cause I don't yeah. even know none. Yeah. I'm my first softball pro I ever met. Yeah. Yeah. Man, yeah, that's so lit. fucking yeah, dope, lit. yo. Hey, y'all lit. Yeah. Y'all lit. Y'all, y'all can tell y'all see she lit, man. Man, tell the people where to follow you at and where to follow your team, man, cause we need to goddamn check on some of your games, man. We need, to, we need to check some of these goddamn softball games. I see what you doing out there in the outfield. I don't know if it's men, but it's good. Yeah, we can, we can zoom in. Yeah, y'all, she stole somebody's Instagram, so y'all make sure y'all follow her Instagram. She stole. <laughs> <laughs> and make sure y'all support her because it ain't that many softball players that I know professionally and I just met one. So y'all support y'all softball players because they need support. It's not, it's not even that many black players. Yeah, that's damn. Yeah, we do. We definitely got us a rare interview right here. Like, what the? Like, y'all need to definitely tap in because um, softball lit as fuck. And we ain't got one in Atlanta, and that's definitely lame because we got every sport in Atlanta. Right, right, right. <laughs> <laughs> but appreciate you talking to me today, yeah, yo. Yo, having. definitely, yo. Watch out for the haters and for the fastballs. <laughs> <laughs> the purple shell.